welcome back. It's me, Tsiba, and back again. And today I'm going to make a how to video. And this is basically just for those people that don't exactly know how to work Mule Dump. Um, it's basically the same for PC and Mac, except I'm running it on a uh, MacBook. So, I mean, the steps are the same. Just kind of follow along, and it's going to be the right, uh, same. All right. So, to start off, you're going to want to download um, this file here, the .zip. It will be in the description. Once you um, unarchive it, you're going to get a folder with this name. Once you do this, you're going to want to, I mean, these are basically things, so this is like, um, it's probably read me explaining how to do it, but it might not be in full detail, and it's probably a lot easier to listen to someone telling you what to do than reading. Um, you'll dump, this is basically what you're going to drag on to your browser. This is basically the information that uh, this will basically, I mean, this is the information that this will run off of, so why don't we open this up. So basically you're going to see the accounts underscore sample dot js. Um, open that up with text edit or notepad or whatever you're using. So once you open it up, you're going to see all these things. You don't have to worry about any of this. It's fine. If you want to, it's like switch to testing, and it will price display. This is a little outdated, so I wouldn't use this. One click login, blah, blah, blah. You can, this is like, it's, you don't have to. This is just like by choice if you want to. All right, so you're going to, you're going to see these two things where email and pass, email to, email uh, pass to. And these basically, um, all they are is, uh, sorry, I'm getting a little mind blank here. So basically, this is the outline you're going to have to use for all your accounts that you type in. So what I, what I would recommend is I would recommend deleting uh, the second line. And just because you're going to be making, if you have a lot of mules, just kind of put in a lot of them there. Just because I like to have a lot of them. But just make sure, because every single one has to have the same formatting. So if you mess something up, then it won't work. And uh, I've had that happen after entering like 20 mules, and it gets very annoying after a while. So make sure you get this uh, right. All right, so let us open up uh, Realm. Let's create a new uh, new register here. Let's make it hi. Okay, now let's make it hmm, how to yield up at gmail.com. Password is pass uh, password. Password, if you guys want to log on this, go ahead, be my guest. It's not even anything, so. Yep. Alright, so just register there. Okay. How to mule dump at gmail.com. And then here we enter how to mule dump at gmail.com. I don't think the email's um, case, like uh, uppercase sensitive, but the password is done. I did lowercase, so password. You're going to want to save that and. Um, just kind of log in. You don't have to name your character. Just log in. All right. Once you do that, just kind of minimize that. All right. So you have this. You save it. Close it. Quit the application. And then rename. Just delete the sample in the underscore. So it's .js. Then you're going to want to open uh, your browser back up. And you're going to drag the mule, mule dump .html right there on the browser. And there we go. There is the character. Uh, if you can't see it. But, yeah. That's basically how to work it. I think if I name it, then it will uh, register it to even more things. But basically what it's showing here right now is the eight slots it has, which I believe are just its inventory space. If I think of, if I reload it, uh, I don't know. So you guys, that's basically how to work Mule Dump. If you have any more questions, please don't hesitate to ask me them in the description. If you'd like to log on to this and make it 88 for me, be my guest. I'm just kidding. You don't have to do that. Uh, it's just me, me mule dump how ho oh, sure mule dump ho all right guys so um i'll see you guys uh next time but like i said questions in the, in the comments i will answer them if if you keep posting the same question i probably won't answer them but other than that most of the questions are probably answered on um the actual mule dump page i'm not going to find that it probably Easy enough to find on Google, but yeah, guys, if you like the tutorial, just leave a like. Um, yeah, see you guys next time.